Right, good day and welcome, November 2013, 2.3, given 0, minus half, 0, half, 0, 3 over 2, 0. So as you should see, every odd number, term 1, term 3, term 5, term 7, they all 0 and all my even numbers form a sequence that's minus half, plus 1 would give me half, plus 1 would give me 3 over 2, plus 1, 5 over 2. Now assume that this number pattern continues consistently. Write down the value of the 191st term, so 191 odd number. As you can see all the odd numbers, 0. So from here I can conclude that term 191 equals 0. Right? 2.3.2 determine the sum of the first 500 terms of the sequence. So 250 of those are 0. I hope you follow. Right? And the other 250 is part of the sequence where a is minus half and t equals to 1. Alright, so you can say the sum to 500 terms equal 250 divided by 2 because the other 250 is 0. 2 times my a value which is minus 1. Remember it's n over 2, 2 times a plus n minus 1 times t. And as I said, 250 of them are 0. So the other 250 a is minus half, 250 minus 1, 249. My common difference is 1, so I get 31,000. Or, there they've just done it differently, 31,000. Right, so hope you follow, hope you understand. Don't get caught out to this in exams. Right, all the best, God bless, bye.